they are here to act in one point, to act as teachers of mankind from the realms of spirit. They are the guide coming to us. Great wisdoms, keys to the ascension procedures happening in each one of us. Remember, we are all growing. We are increasing in energies and frequencies. We are developing new chakras. We are bringing forth a full enlightenment, a full growth of all the meridians in our body, all 206 of them. As for the Ascended Masters, there are thousands of Ascended Masters from the Earth and other spheres who have joined St. Germain's grand work. As it says here, they are the living, tangible beings who raised their bodies into ascension, as did, as did Yeshua, who left an etheric record of the ascension over the hill of, of Bethany. They are wholly divine and beyond the realm of human mistakes. These great beings of light and of love are the elder brothers and sisters of humanity. They are here to guide us. They are here to be divine supervisors using their love and light to take us along the sacred path that all of us are to follow. In doing this, they give assistance without limit to all who will call to them and make individual effort to serve the constructive way of life. All of them are around us now, all of them ready to help, to come forth and allow us all to see the beauty, the magnificence of who they are and what they are about. Remember, what we are doing right now is shifting the consciousness paradigm. And in, in doing so, we understand that consciousness is the vehicle for sp spiritual awareness. So as the consciousness paradigm raises from limited to full consciousness, the vehicle for spiritual awareness grows. And like this little picture here, it allows us to embrace all aspects greater than ourselves within the cosmos, to integrate within ourselves all that we are, and to understand ourselves as well as the great oneness that we all embody. So we are evolving. The ascension process is watched over, as I said, by the ascended masters, and it began in earnest in the early 1970s. In the early 1970s, the ascension process truly began for all of us. We are all part of this amazing process of change. What happened that brought this really together was the stopping of the destruction of our sun. The sun nearly went nova on us and wiped us all out in the 1970s. That did not happen because the Creator, the great supreme force that is one, uh, one with us, that has made all of us, that has brought us down in this path of light and of love, did not let that happen. It was the first great sign in the universe, in the heavens, that the great change was now underway. And from that point forward to the point what we are about to reach, we have met, moved through, and become one with all in physicality as we raise up toward our ascension, our enlightenment. 